Hey, this is Ryan from Web Eminence with a quick tip for adding video to your website and specifically uh, a tip for using YouTube to host your video and then embedding that on your website. This issue comes up a lot with my website clients. Uh, a lot of times they'll send me a video, maybe they took it on their phone or they have a video file they want to include on their website. You can definitely take that file and upload it to your website. You can upload it to WordPress into the media library and then display it on a website and WordPress usually handles most video files pretty well. So this one is playing from a video file right in WordPress. The issue with doing it this way is depending on your hosting, it might not be really optimized to play video. So that's one problem. Videos generally are large files, so they can take up a lot of storage. So this is just a short video um, under two minutes and it's 10 megabytes, so not, not huge, but you can end up with much larger files than that with a longer video or a high quality video file that hasn't been optimized. So you'll run into storage issues on your hosting and you can also run into bandwidth issues if you're having people land on your website, getting a lot of traffic and then having people playing videos continuously maybe you have multiple videos on your site, can turn into a lot of bandwidth usage and you might hit some bandwidth limits on your hosting account. So the better option in most cases and what I recommend to my clients is to first upload the video to YouTube and then we'll use the video hosted by YouTube and embed it on the website. It sounds really difficult to people and it scares some people so I'll sometimes do it for my clients. But I want to make this video for my clients and also anyone who wants to upload a video to YouTube that they can then put on their website. Or maybe you're just exploring how to add a video to your site in general. Here's one way to do it. So the first step obviously is to go to youtube.com in your browser. You can actually sign in to YouTube with any Google account. So if you have a Gmail account, you're probably already signed into it. And in the upper right hand corner, you'll probably see your icon and you're already logged in. If you see sign in, like it shows here, that means you're not logged in yet. So you'll need to create a Google account or log in. When you are logged in, you can go ahead and click this upload link right here. I'm gonna go ahead and switch over to this account where I'm already logged in. Uh, this is an account I use to host some videos for random videos for clients who don't wanna upload it themselves. I'm gonna go ahead and click that upload button. It's gonna take me to a window here where I can select files to upload. You can click here to browse folders on your computer to find the file, or you can open a window with the video file and just drag it over there, let go, and it's gonna start uploading. Depending on the size of the file, it can take a while. This one's going pretty fast. So it took about 10 seconds to upload. It's still processing, but I'll mention here that you can make the video unlisted or private. Unlisted means someone will need a link to find it. Um, you'll need to make it unlisted or public in order to play it on your site. You can choose a video thumbnail here from the uh, generated thumbnails. You can add a description. Here it would be smart to add a description and a link to your website because if this video is public, someone might find it searching in YouTube and it's just another reason to put the video on YouTube because it's another place for people to find you. So the processing is done. Um, here's the video, it says your video will be live. So I can go ahead and click this link and see the video played live. I do need to go back to the uh, screen here and make it, it is public. I gotta hit publish. And then I will go back and refresh this video. So it is now live on YouTube. There's a few ways to put this video on your site now. You can obviously link to this video, but you probably want to embed it right on your website. So you can click share. Um, you can grab this link here, copy it. I'll copy that for now. You can also click embed, and it's gonna give you some options for getting HTML code to embed right into your website. You should be able to use that HTML code in any website builder or platform. Uh, WordPress is obviously pretty popular. Um, so if you're using WordPress, you can just paste in a YouTube link and it's just going to embed it for you. Um, you could preview this page and see that the video is just embedded on the site. There's a lot more you can do with YouTube embeds to clean it up a little bit. You can remove these controls um, and this title here. There's always going to be something showing, but you can make it cleaner so it always looks more like this um, from the start. So I'll cover that in a blog post. I'll link to that below the video. 
but this just gives you an idea of how you can upload a video to YouTube quickly and then use it on your website. So now this video is playing off YouTube servers, so it's not taking your bandwidth. It should play fast. Uh, YouTube knows a thing or two about streaming video and compressing video and all the, doing all the things that make video play fast. So it makes sense to rely on their technology uh, rather than just putting it on your server that may or not be uh, optimized for playing videos, especially if you're playing a lot of videos or large files, really high quality video. So I hope you find that helpful. Feel free to ask questions if you have them in the comments below and like the video if you found it useful and check out some of my other ones. We'll see you on the next one.